Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to fix fingerprint sensor not working, fingerprint sensor calibration needed of Samsung A32 Galaxy phone. I will also show you how to flash your A32 Galaxy. So watch the video complete, don't skip any part. Your finger sensor will not work if you have changed the display of your phone or you have changed the panel of your phone. I have changed this phone display and now its fingerprint sensor is not working. Now if I go in the settings and I open the biometric settings, when I press OK on fingerprints, a message will pop up saying fingerprint sensor calibration needed. Contact customer service for help. If this happens to you or you have any other problem of software, then this video is for you. So now I will show you how to download A32 flash file and Odin 3 software that is required to upload the flash file. First of all, open your browser and search for Samsung A32 flash file download and hit enter. You are watching that the first link is Sam Mobile. Click here viewers, there are many other sites but I have tested this site software so I am recommending this. When the site is open you, you are watching that you can select your phone model and you can also select your country because it will download the flash file according to your country. So select your country and then click it. My country is Pakistan. I have clicked it. Now next page pop ups. Here on the right side viewers, you can see download Odin. Click here. Because this is the file necessary to flash your software. Without this you can't flash your software. It is downloading. Now I will open the folder containing Odin setup. I will extract it. It is extracted viewers. Now I will open it. Viewers, its interface look like this. Now Close it and now we will download the actual file. Click on join to download. Guys here select individual. Guys here I will tell you another thing that this site you can't download without signing up. So this is the form. Simple form viewers you will have just to enter a username and create a password and give the email id. So this is very basic form viewers. No extra thing you have to add. Click on I have read the terms and conditions and complete registration. So viewers I have already downloaded a32 flash file to save the time. Now power off the phone and connect it through the data cable and to the other side. To the PC or laptop. Here is the downloaded file viewers. Open Odin 3 and select this file. You have to select the AP file viewers. You are watching that our file is now loading. It will take some time. So be impatient because I think this is a 4 or 5 GB file. Now press on start and you are watching that our file is now flashing. You can also see the progress bar here. Also you can see the progress on your phone. 
guys remember one thing that if you find an error during the upgrade i have made another video i will share the link in the video description so watch it and clear your error i have shown there why you got this error so wait for some time till the file flashes also you can see the progress on the phone viewers this will take some time so be impatient also make sure your pc or laptop is connected to power supply now guys it is going to be 100% and we will see a pass message our phone is flash viewers now i will press the power key guys it will take some time for the first time after flashing the firmware so don't worry this is samsung a32 galaxy the flash procedure is same for all the similar models like a56 a52 a72 now this is the initial setup i will do it carry on the on screen setup viewers it will take some time enter your google account and password now viewers here we can add security features like fingerprints pattern and pin password so i will select fingerprints because it was not working earlier continue it is saying that set a pin or password now i have entered the pin and now it is saying register your fingerprint place your finger in the center of the scanning target now i will scan my finger guys you are watching that it is working before flashing the firmware it was giving the error that calibration is needed guys i am again saying that this will happen if you change the touch screen or panel of your phone our finger is added 100% now i'll press the next skip the other things and directly i will show you the fingerprint sensor working or not so here is the main page of our mobile now i will lock it and i will unlock it by fingerprint i am pressing the finger viewers you are watching that our fingerprint sensor is working now like the video if this helps thanks for watching goodbye